This is a Susan G. Komen Race for the Cure at UCF. When I decided to do this race, I had to ask myself, what do I like to do for fun? And if you guys know me, I like to find really kooky, quirky places around Florida and abroad to uh, explore. Recently, I've been challenged to actually run the Disney Princess Half Marathon. And I've been really hard pressed to examine what I actually do with the funds that I actually have. And lately I've been having so much fun doing all these races leading up to the half marathon that the 30 bucks it cost me to go to the beach, I felt that it actually will have a bigger impact in my community if I invest in some of these races instead of just running into the neighborhood. So this week we ran the Susan G. Coleman Race for the Cure out in UCF. It's their 15 year anniversary here. And guys, I've been to a lot of races, and they've been fun, but this race is like a mobile party. I can't tell you how much fun we had here. We met so many great people that we had never seen a day in our life. We saw some old people that we already knew. Hi. <laughs> and we I mean, just had a ball. I mean, people really, really, really get behind this one. Seriously, it's like going to just like a humongous concert slash sporting event slash party i mean it really got crazy i mean this is just the beginning for the weekend a lot of the racers hung out for a little longer and went to one of the games and they had all kinds of swag that went along with it i'm always shocked about how much fun people have uh, going to these races you know and this looks like the slow crowd, but what happened is that we got there a little late, so we got put back with the walkers, and it was just so many people, there was no way we were going to be able to get past this crowd, and even though Zumi left us a few times, we made it through. I was really shocked on how big and how much the campus has grown here at UCF. I mean, honestly, it came from a little college when I was a kid to be in the second largest college in the United States. Fight like a girl. <laughs> So the Pegasus is strong these days, and the race was amazing. This is the finish line, and we made it. We didn't have to take any breaks or anything like that. There was plenty of, plenty of, plenty of swag to get after the race. I mean, there was a guy there at New Balance. All of the big businesses in the area were there. I love this shirt here. Her sister designed the character. She actually has one on the front and one on the back. Little Tiki girl. Um... This right here is my favorite family of the day. And I saw a lot of them, but I just wanted to share these guys with you. The whole family tie-dyed their own t-shirts. So these are all custom tie-dyed t-shirts. And then the guys wore sequence capes that would make James Brown jealous. 